Oh, I, I, I think he is a war criminal. Will you be meeting with him? Will you go to Poland? Will you go to Poland? Was the president's remarks speak for themselves? Uh, he was speaking from his heart and speaking from what he's seen on television. Make sure that we're. Uh, we're prepared and we're taking steps to, to mitigate that, uh, to help people uh, with the cost of living. Uh, so next week we're going to be setting out the, uh, the energy strategy for, uh, for the UK. Massive uh, jump forward on, uh, on renewables, uh, more nuclear, uh, using our own hydrocarbons uh, more effectively. Also looking at what we can do to source hydrocarbons from places other than Russia. We've got to get off uh, Russian hydrocarbon. Is that it's not just that they've got oil. They're also some of the biggest investors uh, here in the, in the Gulf uh, in UK renewables. In our Emirati investment in UK wind farms, already huge. Uh, what more can they do? Uh, we, need to, we need to double the, the pace of our, of our construction of wind farms. We're already the, one of the biggest producers of offshore wind power in the world. When we look at the the, the dependency that uh, the West in particular has built up on uh, Putin's hydrocarbons, uh, on Putin's oil and gas, we can see what a mistake that was because he's been able to blackmail. So we have long, long standing relationships with uh, this part of the world and we need to recognize the, the very important uh, relationship that we have and the strength of, of that relationship, uh, not just in, in hydrocarbons. This is about investment in the, in the UK over the long term. And, uh,